The next feature I want to go over here is the ammeter. That's how we're going to measure current in a circuit. And the most common place we use this in the automotive application, uh, probably at least a few times a week, we're looking for a parasitic drain on the battery. And that's basically when there's something that's activating while the car should be asleep. Something's drawing some current. Now, it could be something as simple as a dome light left on. Maybe your glove box light, you left the glove box open for some reason. You were grabbing something on the way out of the car and uh, you forgot to close it. Modern cars will usually smart enough to power down those systems. They've got body control modules. So older cars like this won't do that. So I'm going to give you an example of how this works and show you what it looks like. The first thing we need to do is to switch the leads around on this meter. So we were measuring voltage last. The next thing we're going to do, I'm going to turn this meter off and we're going to switch the red lead over to the amperage section. This one here is fused for 10 amps, so we can do anything up to 10 amps passing through this meter. Again, we're going to hook this in line, in series is what they call it. So we have to disconnect the negative cable and then we have to put these two leads in between the negative cable and the battery. 